Well, it may not be open to students yet or built for that matter, <laughs> but that's not stopping some parents and students from showing off their school spirit. They're making some noise tonight. Parents and students casting their ballots for mascot on the colors of the new high school in Benita Springs. And four in your corners, Adam Pinsker showing you the district also used it to make a recruiting pitch to your student. He is a principal without a school. I think I need to find a better adjective than exciting, but I've been saying exciting over and over again for, for about a week now. Jeff Estes will be the principal of Benita Springs High School when it opens for the 2018-2019 school year. For now, he's asking students like Jordan White to be among nearly 300 students enrolled when the doors open. Everybody's going to a new school and being able to try and be one of the first ones to graduate. Jordan's dad is excited about the career readiness programs the school is offering, along with partnerships with FGCU that allow students to earn their associate's degree while still in high school. What I'm excited for is the AP classes, honor classes, and of course ROTC. Along with traditional learning, SD says Benita High will have programs not normally seen in high school. We're going to have a seed to table program where we're going to we're going to grow our own crops and we're going to have solar panels, a garden. But before the school can grow, it has to first find its identity. In Benita Springs, Adam Pinsker, Fox 4, in your corner. Lake County Schools saying they'll eventually open up the voting for a new mascot name. I like the skunk apes, but that's my opinion. They're going to do this online before they pick the winning name.